Hey guys, Mick from Oztrax 4x4 here. Today I'm just going to show you a little bit of a project I've been working on for my upcoming Simpson Desert Trip, which I haven't mentioned to anyone yet. So yeah, that is coming up in around four weeks time. So what I've been doing is I've been building a jerry can holder for the roof. ARB wanted around $240 thereabouts for their jerry can holder. And I thought that, you know, that's a little bit too much. So let's do a little bit of DIY and um, make something up out of some other products. Okay, so this here is two Titan roller rack jerry can holders bolted together. So, just come over here and show you that. So, I've bolted them through here. They come with pre-drilled holes in the sides. So, as I say, they are sticking out. So I do have a solution for that too, so. And same over this side. Now, what I have done is I've drilled some holes there to use with some U-bolts. So with those U-bolts, I'll bolt that through onto my flat rack and I'll secure the front section of it. This rear section here, which I haven't actually started on yet, I'll be drilling a hole and running some flat washers through to lock it onto the mesh of the rack. And that's pretty much it really, like it's pretty straightforward. You can set it to whatever length you want. I'm running my jerry cans in uh, on, their, on their sides, I guess. As you would say, you wouldn't stand them up on this. I just keep the center of gravity low for when I'm traveling. And obviously, as soon as I run low on the fuel, we're putting the jerry cans uh, contents into the fuel tanks um, just to keep my weight down off the spit off the roof as I have a spare wheel up there as well with some firewood, which we have to carry with us here in South Australia. So I'll uh, just put the jerry can in and I'll show you what it looks like. All right, so this is with the jerry can sitting in there. As you can see, don't mind the messy uh, bench at the moment so she'll sit in there like that there's a fair bit of a gap on this side as you'll see where those bolts come through but jerry cans actually sitting over towards them so if I pull that across here so you see there's a fair bit of a gap I have a solution for that too so so this is my solution it's foam adhesive matting that I'm going to stick to the actual jerry cans themselves rather than the actual jerry can holder Though I may change my mind on that. So yeah, this here will sit down the side as so. As you can see, that will go down in there and uh, that'll stop it rubbing. Same with on the bottom there. And uh, yeah, that's my plan really for, for my jerry can holders for the roof. Um, now these do come with uh, ratchet straps uh, bolt onto an eye hook, so it'll be like an eye hook around about here. You just run your strap over both the jerry cans and on the other side and secure it on the roof that way so they don't come out. Um, yeah, and that's about it, guys. So, what I'll do, weather's pretty terrible. I'll do a second part, which will be up next week, and I'll show you how I've mounted it all up and the, some new jerry cans all secured. These are temporary, as you can see. 1973, they're pretty rusty. Not going to be very good for what I'm doing. So, so yeah, that's my jerry can set up, guys. So, a little bit of a view around here. Give you an idea of uh, running two jerry cans side by side, keeping the center of gravity low. Um, if you like the video so far, so there you go, guys. That's my jerry can holder that I'm currently working on, my little project. I'll put links in the description down below uh, to show you what I purchased and all the bolts and nuts and everything that you'll need once it's all complete. Next week hopefully the weather's a little bit better and I'll get around to filming the install of it and finishing off that rear section with a couple of flat washers and a bolt to hold it down onto the mesh. Other than that, thanks for watching. If you haven't done so, please subscribe. Helps me make more videos for you guys. And as always, have a good one guys. Catch you next time.